Welcome riding buddies. This week what we're going to do is we're going to look at the religion of motology. Now this is the religion that Ding is involved with. He's invited me along to check out what goes on with it and uh, we'll have a little look see it's very prestigious you've got to be invited to be able to do to to join the church of motology but um, I have been invited along as long as I've been involved with motorbikes it's been many years but I've never actually been involved with the uh, with the religion of motology but um, I'm pretty excited about having a look at it and we'll check it all out and a lot of stuff we're not allowed to show you but um, we can go along to one of their sermons and uh, have a look and see what it's all about okay so we're, I'm getting really excited now um, we're about to start the uh, the ceremony for the um, introduction into motology uh, Ding's invited me down there so they're just getting themselves together um, as a new person to the to the religion um, they'll do a few things before I'm allowed to come in um, but yeah so we'll video what we're allowed to video of motology and um, we'll go from there oh hang on Luch I think we're about ready um, let's go That was so moving down there um, with, uh, with Reverend McGuire. Um, the Church of uh, Motoology, it's just, yeah, you've really got to see it to believe it. It's one of those things that if you're, you've got to be in there to understand it properly. Um, yeah, like I've been around bikes basically all my life, and I've always been on the outside of the motoology stuff. But um, after being invited by, uh, by Ding to, to come out and, and sit through a ceremony with Monology, um, I will be becoming a full fledged member. Um, it's, uh, the way they, they talk about the disciples of uh, De Costa, um, Nicola, um, Bell in Australia, there's all different chapters all around the world. Obviously, the head of the chapters is the FIM. Um, don't get me to try and say it because it's, it's said in French and I only speak three languages, Motology, Bad English and Worser or English. So, um, but the FIM is the, the, uh, the head church over in Europe and France. Each country has their own, their own chapters and of course these chapters are broken into different segments. There's the motocross segment as to what I, I'm involved with, what I want to be involved with and what we're looking at here today. The road race guys, they have their leg as well. The trials guys, every, uh, oh, sorry man, but uh, oh, I'm just so touched by, by what, what Reverend McGuire was talking about. But, um, but every discipline has its own chapter. And uh, everyone that's involved in those disciplines gets involved, not everyone, but you've got to be especially picked to go into those into those uh, those sections of it. So if you ever get the chance to go along to a motology um, sermon, you've got to go along to it. You do have to be invited, you can't just rock up. I was very fortunate, my my links with Ding, um, he got me in there and they have accepted me into the church now so I'm really pumped to be able to finally become part of the motology family and uh, yeah, it's just absolutely amazing. Um, just give you got a moment here now, it's just too much. Um, okay, so I've caught up with Reverend McGuire here. Um, so Reverend, um, uh, I know English is actually your second language. Um, so we'll have to talk in English so that people can actually understand you. It's pointless trying to ask Ding to speak English because I understand him better in, in, in motology, but um, how long have you been with the Church of Motology? Brabadi. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, I've been uh, in the Church of Motology since uh, for maybe around 10 or 11 years now. 
Yeah, yeah. Um, how long have you been a reverend for? Oh, it took me quite a while. I um, had to move up the ranks through uh, the motology ranks. So I've uh, finally uh, enlightened myself to the uh, reverend position uh, maybe two or three years ago. That's great. Um, can you can you see like moto motologies? In far as religion goes, it's fairly new because it only sort of really started in the 50s. Um, have you seen much of a surge in the last couple of years with motology members coming through? Absolutely. Uh, we're more brought up than ever before and uh, you know, we see people wanting to come in and uh, find out more about what it is and all the brings and the brats about it and the, the right up arts, it's, um, it's really good to see. Yeah, that's absolutely awesome. Um, so you're, you're president of the Toowoomba Motocross Club and the reverend for the club. Um, and just locally, how has Motology been going? Yeah, good. I, I like to think of myself as a brap spiritual leader. Um, we've got quite a few disciples of the Motology here in the, the club now, and it's, uh, I really enjoy it, and it's great to see you. Know. Okay, thanks heaps, uh, Reverend McGuire. Uh, absolutely. Well, that's motology for you. Uh, I'm completely drained. I'm ready for bed. I'll go and have a shower, hit the sack. It was just such an emotional day. I'm now being accepted into the motology family, and I'm really pumped about that. I'm looking forward to what the future beholds for me in the church. Uh, a very big thank you to Reverend McGuire for all his assistance today and the whole flock for accepting me in. If you want to find out more about your local Motology church, duck along to your local club, check it out. As I said, you've got to be invited in. Um, I was lucky enough to know Ding and, and I mentioned it to Ding about it and he got me in there and everything went really well. So it's one of those things you've really got to be clicky with it. But thank you for watching the video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and go back through my library and check out some of my other stuff as well. And we'll catch you next time.